Lava is molten rock that erupts from volcanoes. It can erupt from the volcano summit or from its slopes. Lava flows come in a whole variety of shapes and sizes. Some lavas, called basalts, are runny like honey. They can flow quite easily and sometimes form red-hot rivers like those seen in Hawaii. Spectacular red-hot lava fountains can form at vents which can generate rapidly moving lava flows. Basalt lavas usually move at around walking or running speed, but they can be faster. Lakes of lava can also form where lava pools in the crater. Basalt lavas normally travel less than 10 kilometers, but can flow for tens of kilometers during big eruptions or when enclosed rivers of lava are formed. These are called lava tubes, which keep the lava hot and fluid so it is able to travel further. Other lavas, including andesite and rhyolites, are much less runny than basalt. Instead, they are sticky, like toothpaste or toffee. They ooze out of volcanoes much more slowly, at about a walking pace. Short and thick lava flows form, which usually don't travel far. Sometimes the lava is so sticky that steep-sided domes of lava are formed. All lavas are very hot. Some can reach 1200 degrees Celsius. This is hot enough to set fires and even melt gold, copper, and glass. When lava meets water or ice and snow, the heat rapidly boils the water, resulting in violent explosions and sometimes meltwater floods and mud flows. Everything in the path of an advancing flow can be knocked over, surrounded, burnt, or buried. Scientists are able to provide forecasts about the probable parts of lava flows and can advise on the best course of action for protection of people and property. Although destructive, lavas have some benefits, including as building material, tourist attractions, energy sources, and the creation of new land as it cools and hardens into solid rock.